this is Burning Road for the PS1. This is Toka's attempt to provide a, a Daytona USA-like experience for the PS1. Uh, Daytona was incredibly popular from Sega and received a couple of ports on the Sega Saturn. But this game tries to provide a game which is roughly similar. It looks similar, but the gameplay is not quite up to scratch with, with Daytona. It plays a little bit different and is a little bit loose in its in its handling. Um, the soundtrack's quite entertaining though, um, you'll see more of that later. I picked this game up from Scarborough about five or six years ago from a shop called Game Center, or Game Center 2.0, uh, which was a, a very good independent game store which sadly shut down a few years ago. Okay, let's get on. This is Burning Road. I'll turn the volume on the music down a little bit, it's, uh, it's quite loud in the game. The soundtrack's quite nice on this game, although it's a little bit over the top at times. Uh, it's almost like a spoof on the, the Championship Edition of Daytona. Right, let's do practice. Beginner, yeah. I have no idea. I think I've played this game about once um, since I got introduced to it a few years ago. Uh, let's try this. I owned a, a Sega Saturn in the 1990s, so there are a few games I uh, I missed out on. In your own time. meant to be one screen. Nope, accelerate, okay. The cliffs look like uh, Daytona. The cars look like Daytona, um, but it's not. Ooh. Helicopter in a tunnel, that's brave. The handling's very, very loose. The cars do uh, do slide quite a lot. What are these bins doing? Yeah, the soundtrack's a little bit over the top. It reminds me a bit of. Uh, Ross the Boss from Manowar in the 80s. Let's try a different view. Ah, that's the button. Ah. I do prefer the, uh, the in view camera. Pretty much every game. Um. Ah. The, the cameras on this game are not not very well chosen. Um, that's okay. But sometimes you can't see the road too well.
Ah. I had a Saturn, not a PS1 in this case. Although the PS1 did have Ridge Racer, and uh, later on a lot, a lot better games than the Saturn, like um, Colin McRae and Gran Turismo, so I, I can't really complain. Yeah, let's go for speed. This is on a, a second generation PS1, a smaller one, so it takes a little bit longer to load than it if it was on a PS2, I think. Oh well. Graphically, the game is not bad. There's a lot of pop up. Um, but the game does run fairly quick. Ooh, that's odd. Gone from desert to snow in a few seconds. And back to desert. What's this on the road? It's green. It's like some kind of gel. More bins. Back to the ice. Snow. Comment is just as annoying as uh, Championship Edition Daytona. That game used to keep saying, burning up the tyres, you're burning up the tyres. I might even win this one. Move. Handling models are so strange on this game. What is it with flying uh, aircraft? Come on, move. Cars slide out every corner. Oh. Yeah, I, d I don't think this game's as good as Daytona USA. Um, although I think it would have been quite entertaining in 1996. Uh, I'm not sure if there's a multiplayer 
mode on this game. Uh, but I can see that being quite entertaining and quite fun. Okay, that's enough of me moaning. Thanks for watching.